Hey everyone, I'm Armin Gaming. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a fun little Monster Legend glitch video. I just discovered this today and I have no idea how it happened. Well, that's not necessarily true. I have some idea and I'm going to test it tomorrow morning. But I decided why not make a video about this and just start some speculation going to see if you guys have experienced this and if you have any idea what's going on. So let me click fight. Let's take on anyone. It doesn't matter. And... Bam! Do you see the glitch? Did you see it? Tell me if you saw it. If not, I don't know, maybe you didn't catch it, but you'll catch it after this, I hope. Um, so we'll just, we'll go through this battle, give you guys some time to think about what you just saw, if anything. Um, we'll do Mineral Blood. We'll actually, we'll just finish them off with Volt. Let's do Auto, see if Volt can finish them off himself. 20k Volt, Static Shocks, 20k Volt, Static Shocks, and End. Now this glitch, it's not anything significant, it's not anything too incredible, but it's its a fun little thing and it brings us back to the good old times where you were allowed to use monsters on defense and on offense, which currently now in the game we can't do that. So let's see this play out. Lane odds and blah blah blah, we'll auto the rest of the game. Alright cool, so tell me, who saw it? Who knows? Or maybe, you, maybe you'll be able to figure it out because of the title of this video. But anyhow, the glitch essentially was, did you notice my defense log? My defense log showed my defense team. And who was in my defense team? Well, let's take a look. My defense team consists of Ruby, Canola Oil. My attack team consists of Ruby, Canola Oil. Clearly, I don't have two 130 Nemesis, Zyra and the Ruby with the exact same runes and with the exact same relics. That's the exact same monster that somehow... I've been able to put on defense and on offense. And once again, if you click change, look what it says. Um, for Lao Mu, this monster is already assigned to your attack team. So a monster that's on my attack team, I can't put on my defense team and vice versa. If I go to Fatid, this monster is already, is already assigned on your defense multiplayer team. And my Sherizard, this monster is already assigned on your defense multiplayer team. So how did I do it? How do I have Zyron both on offense and on defense? Right, once again, if we look at my defense log, that's not my defense log, if we look at my battle log, defense. As you can see, Ruby has been on my defense for two days now, almost, or one day and six hours ago, Ruby has been on my defense, I haven't changed my defense. And if you know me, I always have Ruby on defense, I never use Ruby for offense. I'm always using um, Barakor, Sammy, and Elvira, or Elvira, Barakor, and Rossi God. I never take I never take my Ruby out of defense. But when we look at my attack team, take a look at that. All these battles I won 11 minutes ago, 11 minutes ago with Zyron. One minute ago and 27 minutes ago Zyron was on defense. So how am I doing this? And if we even check in my player profile, where's that at? I don't even know how to look at that. Is it my team? My profile? Look at that. Multiplayer attack team. It's canola oil and defense team it's canola oil so that's the fun little glitch so i have a good idea of how it's done and how to replicate so again i'll test it tomorrow but it's also it's a fun little video to see if anyone out there can replicate it because i don't know like it's not it's not like this is game breaking or anything it's just it's a fun little thing so i'm just curious so i'm sure it'll get fixed eventually but again it's not like a big groundbreaking thing it's just a fun little thing where yeah if you are a player that has a really good monster you can essentially use that monster on defense and on offense, so it's pretty cool. With that being said, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time.